Hello there fellow Acolytes of Sega Saturn and welcome to what is hopefully the finale of my Symphony of the Night playthrough. Uh, last time we did the final bit of exploration and it's time to try and defeat Dracula. Just a couple of changes first. There's this pearl I have which between 6pm and 6am boosts like your stats including attack up by 5. So it's going to be better than the attack gauntlet because it provides some other boosts as well. Obviously got the defensive one, and I found out that this thing here um, actually boosts magic power. So that should boost the attack power of my sword, which could be quite useful. I've also found out a couple of other things as well. Right, let me just move this here, because I want to do a bit of organising. Uh, let's get the shield rod, wherever that is. When I tested out the shield rod with the Alucard shield, I was actually fucking up. Because what I was supposed to do is to activate the shield and run into shit. And it does way more damage, apparently. I've not tested it yet, but that's something to bear in mind for Dracula. Um, I might kind of use that as a last-ditch effort, because apparently it's, like, super strong. And I'd like to see how far I can get, you know, without having to do that. If he's kicking my ass, then fuck it, you know. I also want to get up to level 50 first, so I'm going to... Fuck off. So I'm going to fight these guardian dude things. And... Hopefully, level up to level 50. Cool. And there's another one down here. So I'm kind of doing 30 damage to this dude. And your man does 73. It's not bad. Boom. Level up. Well, that was quicker than I thought it would. So, let's go and fight Dracula then. Uh, just say first, now that I'm level 50. Shit, I'm kind of worried, to be honest. I remember, like, cheesing last time with the... Oh, I, say, I can't remember what the name of it is. I think it's the Valman way. It's called the Valman in Army of Despair. But I say that's the weapon that Soma uses. Um... And the one Ali can use, I don't remember, but it looks different. So I think it's probably the Valman way. But yeah, I remember like cheesing most of the game, including like the final boss with that Valman way thing. So yeah. This should be interesting. And I'm fully aware that I want to be safe for map completion. So I'm going to go up one route and then the other route. Just for that little bit of extra map completion, you know? Oh yeah, I've got to be shaft first. Hey, how you got? How's it hanging? Eh, not too bad, shaft. You know. Well, I see you've got the bits to uh, summon your father. Mind passing them here? Thanks. Nah. Don't be silly, dickhead. I don't trust you. Hey, don't be rude. I serve your father. And he trusts me. Give that shit here. Please? Nah, shut up. I'll free my father. You can just go and die. Cheers, fam. Very good. I guess I'll just have to teach you a lesson. Dickhead. Alright, we'll stop speaking then and get on with it. Fine. 
I will. You just sit there, Sonny Jim, and I will kick your little ass. Uh, right, okay, let's use my skull. I want to use it once. Boom, and this. Where the fuck's my shield rod gone? There it is. No. That wasn't too difficult. Oof. You kicked my ass. Damn right. Said I would. You didn't listen to me. You should have listened to me. Alright. No one likes a Mr. Smarty fucking pants. Well, it don't matter in the day. Dracula's still gonna come back. You've got his bits and pieces. You've got his eyes, his rib, his nose, his ball sack. Everything needed to resurrect him. Okie dokie. Oh shit. <laughs> that eyeball. Oh. We're gonna load into the Dracula fight it seems. Okie dokie. Hi daddy. Son! Good to see you again. Thanks for resurrecting me. You wanna help me kill some humans? Nah, Dad. I only resurrected you to kill you. You know. You're a bit of a dickhead these days. Hey. Don't say that. Humans are our slaves. Let's kick their ass. You know it makes sense. Come on, lad. Nah. Well, enough of your shit. What you did to that poor Belmont, lad. Belmont? They're our enemies. Don't say you're friends with them. I'll have to kill you myself, son. You shouldn't do that. You're a very naughty boy. Shut up, Dad. Don't be an idiot. This boss fight's pretty epic. Right, let's change this shield rod to uh, the Alucard sword, and we'll change this to my Alucard shield. Damn, 163. Oh, shit. Damn. Damn. Mm, okay, I've still got a fair bit of health left. Come on, what are you going to do? Like, I'm doing 86, he's doing 170. Damn. Not going his attacks very well. Or maybe I am. Die, monster! Oh wait, that's not my line. Very funny, son. I can't believe you're working with the Belmonts. Sorry, Dad. They are kind of right. 
Um wasn't pissed with humans. You were pissed with humans. Mum kind of thought they were alright. She was a human after all. I guess you're right, son. I guess you're right. But I'm still gonna come back. And kill them all. Alucard. You wait. I'll be back. Will you join me then? Probably not. After all, I'm just like you, I'm a vampire. I live quite a long time. By the time you come back, I'll probably still be thinking the same. So don't be silly, Dad. Don't bother coming back. Or I'll just have to kick your ass again. Very well. It is such a shame that you think that way. Tell you what though, that sword was pretty fucking epic during that battle. I was chipping away at Dracula and that sword was just going like a fucking boss. And there we have it. That's the end of Symphony of Night and the end of my playthrough. This, I believe, is the best ending because I've got the... Uh, not the highest percentage, but I've got the highest bracket of percentages. I don't remember what the ending's supposed to be, so I don't know what the difference between a normal ending and the best ending is like. I just know that there is a best ending, which is on the PlayStation version, and I assume that it's the same for this one, but honestly, I don't really know. It could be different, it could just be one ending, but if it is the best ending, then I've got it. If it's just a normal ending, then hey ho, at least I've done a fair bit of exploration. Yeah, I think it is the best ending, because there's something here with... I'm sure one of them isn't there. I'm sure either Maria or Richter isn't there, like in the bad ending, or the normal ending. I don't remember. I'm not doing voiceovers for this part. I know I've done voiceovers for the other sections, but... I'm joining in a bit too late now, so it doesn't make any sense. Tell you what though, I do like Richter's clothes in this. His normal clothes, like his Rondo blood clothes, are pretty cool. But that long blue jacket is also pretty nifty. Yeah, Richter's cool. Out of all the Belmonts, Richter's definitely my favourite. He's so fucking badass. Like in Rondo of blood, he's so amazing. And he's even really cool in Harmony Despair. Like, that's one of my main regrets when I played Harmony of Despair, which, I mean, the game's probably dead now. I don't have a 360 anymore, so I can't play it. But I imagine no one's playing it anymore, because it's a multiplayer only game. Well, it's not multiplayer only, but if you play a single player, you're going to get your ass kicked. But, yeah, anyway, I tried playing as Richter, and he's got some really cool moves. Like, he does this fucking sliding move on the floor, and he can do, like, these... Sliding kicks. He's really fucking badass. But I just couldn't play with him. Play as him. I was shit. I always stick with like um. I quite liked uh, uh, Alucard. He was okay. Soma was really good because of his soul abilities. Um, Shinoa was really good. And who else did I play as? Um, it wasn't Maria. There was Shinoa that I used to play as, Al you can't sometimes, Soma a lot, and... I know I played as Getsu Fumaden for a while, I don't remember, 
I mean, I used to play it when um, back when it first came out, which was fucking ages ago. That was probably around a similar time as when this got released on XBLA. So it's been maybe like 10 years or something. It's been quite a fair while. Um, so I don't remember much of it, but fucking how many despair. That's such a great game. I really, really wish they'll make a sequel. I know like Konami just does fucking pachinko machines and stuff. And everyone complains about everything they do. You know, for good reason, to be honest. But I really hope they make How Me Despair 2. I mean, I'm probably one of the few people that would actually want it, but... Yeah, I definitely want one. Such a cool game. Right, well, I'm going to cut it off there. Uh, I'll let the credits play through, but I'm going to stop talking now. So if you really want to watch the credits, you can stay and watch it. If not, then... Thanks a lot for joining me on this journey and see you next game, whatever that is, because I haven't decided yet. Right, bye.